Story at six families on the northwest side woke up in disbelief after a fire destroyed five cars in their driveways. The incident happened this morning on Greencrest Drive near I-10 and Vance Jackson. Ken's five reporter Simone Simpson joins us live to explain. Simone. Two homeowners are left feeling helpless after their cars are complete losses. What's worse? is that they don't know how this could have happened. At 2 a.m., two families in a northwest side neighborhood were devastated by a fire. One of the homeowners impacted was Ana Hernandez. Tragedia aún no sabemos qué es lo que pasó. A tragedy happened, not sure what happened. When we came and woke up, the truck was already on fire and burned, and this truck started the other, and then we lost all four cars. A total of five cars were lost. Neighbor Ismael Ponce's truck was damaged. In reality, we don't know. We just heard noises. When my daughter came out, everything was in flames. I don't know. I really don't know what happened. In reality, somebody could have passed by and threw something, but I really don't know. This was a neighbor's view a few doors down. All of a sudden, we just saw a light that started right here. So it started here, moved to that one, and burned the other one. The truck hadn't started up yet, but with all the heat, it started to melt a little bit. But we threw water on it. Hernandez's family does not have surveillance footage. Ponce says he does, but nothing was captured. But he says his neighbor's camera did. The ones that capture stuff here, they just saw a car pass by. But they don't know. It's under investigation. We're going to see what happens, but nobody saw anything. Hernandez is relying on her faith to get through this shattering time. We feel a lot of sadness. For what reason would someone want to do this? God knows what happened, and we're just waiting it out to see what God's will is. God's going to give us the strength to keep going forward because it's me and my kid and my husband. Because we're barely going, and we have another baby coming. SAPD and SAFD responded to this early morning call, and we are still waiting to hear more of those details. What we do know is that arson was called to investigate. Reporting live from the Northwest side, Simone Simpson, Ken's Five. Thank you, Simone.